What are the risks of having a retinal detachment operation? I think the first thing to say is that if you don't have a retinal detachment operation, then you will lose vision in the eye. So it's important that the diagnosis is made and treatment is carried out in an appropriately timely fashion. The risks of the surgery are, as with any eye operation, the one in a thousand chance of hemorrhage or infection. So that's the risk of losing vision in the eye that's being operated upon. The other risk is if the patient has not had cataract surgery, then we would estimate that within two years, 20% of patients will require for the cataract to be operated upon. The operations to correct uh, retinal detachment are um, effective in 95% of people. So there is a small risk that the retinal procedure won't work. And that can be because of scar tissue forming on the surface of the retina, forming around the hole, pulling the hole open, and the retina either doesn't uh, reattach or attaches and then detaches later. So that would require a further operation to sort out. There are smaller risks, for example, the pressure can go up in the eye and that can be treated with eye drops. Using uh, minimally invasive surgery, the vitrectomy procedure, means that the recovery period is much less and uh, can be, people can be back at work uh, within a week or so and the visual improvement can occur within two to four weeks. Because we're now using almost universally uh, minimally invasive techniques for repairing retinal detachments, the post-operatively there is uh, much less discomfort and the recovery period is much quicker for patients. There have been two ways of fixing a retinal detachment. Uh, one is to apply a piece of uh, silicone plastic to the outside of the eye uh, to push the wall of the eye in against the retina and so that it uh, sticks down. This has been uh, superseded by minimally invasive surgery, the vitrectomy, and this results in much quicker uh, recovery for vision, uh, much less discomfort for the patient, and much better long-term comfort for the patient.